Kids, I want to tell you the story of how I met your mother. Again? This is gonna take forever! Yeah, like nine seasons forever. I know, kids. I'm just kidding. I do want to tell you a story, though, and it's pretty legend, wait for it, dairy. It was 2008, and I decided to play in a dodgeball tournament at my church. I needed a team, so I asked some of my friends to help me out. Hey! What's up, guys? What's up? You guys wanna play some dodgeball? Sure. Show. Sure. Oh. Show. We didn't really know what we were up against, so we trained. Oh! Nine! <laughs> and trained. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Until Team Super Friends was finally ready to play. We did really well. We actually ended up making it to the finals. But then this happened. It definitely wasn't one of our best moments. I swear, kids, that one guy on the other team was a true professional. Yeah. So after that, we went home. Man, what did we do wrong? Everything! Man, why'd you have to drop the ball like that? What's wrong, man? Come on. You a boss! We argued a bit, but then... Whoa, 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 hey, whoa, calm, whoa, calm down, whoa, calm down. You know what we should do? What? Play brawl. Okay. Alright, alright, okay. And all of a sudden, everything was great again. Moral of the story, kids, winning isn't everything. That day, we didn't get a golden dodgeball or a trophy, but I was reminded that the real prize in life is having friends who will stick by you no matter what, win or lose. It's